On this episode of Geekiest of the Geeks, I'll be reviewing Uprooted, a new novel by Naomi Novik, and talking about the first season of The Flash. Hi, I'm your host Doug Croft. First up is my review of Uprooted by Naomi Novik, which just came out on May 19th, published by Del Rey. This is the story of Agnieszka, a young woman who lives in a valley threatened by a malevolent forest on its borders. But the valley and its people are protected by a wizard who holds back the wood and the evil creatures within it. But in return for his protection, every ten years, the wizard chooses a young woman from the valley to serve him for a ten-year period. And now that she has been chosen, Agnieszka must learn why the wizard chose her, as she struggles to protect her people from the wood and what it intends to do to them. I bought this book on Kindle and read it through in a single day. The story hooked me and engaged me right away. It has a strong connection to Eastern European fairy tales, and Baba Yaga is brought up a number of times, although in the story she's a mythical witch called Jaga. I also love the idea of a corrupted fairy tale forest itself as the villain of the story. I mean, how do you fight something as vast and as inhuman as a forest? And the wood can spread its corruption through those who come into contact with it. And not only that, but the wood also has the ability to think, to plan, and to set traps. So it's not just a mindless force of nature. If you like this sort of creepy, Brothers Grimm-like fairy tale story, then this is a book that you'll probably enjoy. But, on the other hand, I think the ending to the story had some problems. There is an unpleasant hint of deus ex machina hanging over it. And worse, I think the author herself knew it because she acknowledged it in the story. And the romantic overtones between the protagonists felt out of place. I think the story would have actually been stronger if she had just dropped that entirely. Because it seems to have so little motivation that it makes me think the author wasn't confident we would like the characters on their own. So she tried to make them more sympathetic by introducing a romance. I'm giving this book three and a half creepy trees out of a possible five. The Flash was my favorite new show in the 2014 fall TV season. And for those not familiar with the DC Comics character, the show itself does a great job of summing up the Flash's backstory. My name is Barry Allen, and I am the fastest man alive. When I was a child, I saw my mother killed by something impossible. My father went to prison for her murder. Then an accident made me the impossible. To the outside world, I'm an ordinary forensic scientist, but secretly, I use my speed to fight crime and find others like me. And one day, I'll find who killed my mother and get justice for my father. I am The Flash. The big three in the DC Comics universe are Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. But arguably, the fourth place slot will go to The Flash. He's a founding member of the Justice League, and the transition from Jay Garrick to Barry Allen started the Silver Age of DC Comics. So the Flash TV series has big shoes to fill, and in my opinion, they're doing a great job doing so. There are a lot of crossover episodes with the already established Arrow, and they include a few characters from the 1990s Flash TV show as regulars in this season. There are Villains of the Week episodes, especially in the first half of the season, but there's also a strong serialized story arc that spans the first season. Uh, fans of the comic books can guess who the big nemesis of the Flash is during the course of the season, 
just by looking at the show's introduction. But the writers and the showrunners do a good job of hiding the villain's identity and his motivations. We're never quite sure what his plans are or what his endgame is. But the real heart of the show comes from the complicated and touching relationships between the main characters of the show. And the cast of this show does a great job putting 110% of themselves into each episode. No one's phoning it in. And that's what elevates this show from good to great. It avoids the angst and the darkness of a DC comic show like Arrow or Gotham, and just delivers fantastic characters with a really interesting plot. It was you. You were the one in my house that night. You killed my mother. Why? If you want to know that, you're going to have to catch me. lightning he's out there and i had him he got away i was so close i promised you that i would get you out of here every day you've spent in here has been because of him until today now you're in here because of me, and I'm so sorry. I... Barry. <laughs> Barry, this is not your fault. Look at me. I know what you've given up. Every decision you've made in the past 14 years has been because of me and your mom. What you studied, why you became a CSI, even with Iris. Iris, you're my son. You don't think I know how you love her. But you never pursued her. Because you were too consumed with what happened to me and your mom to let yourself have a life. Well, let it go now, Barry. Hear me now. The man in the yellow suit. He's taken enough from us already. Don't let him take any more. Thank you for tuning into this week's episode. Again, the book is Uprooted by Naomi Novik. I recommend reading it, especially if you're a fan of that kind of dark, grimy, Brothers Grimmish fairy tale kind of story. And The Flash, I cannot say enough good things about this series. If you're not watching it, what is wrong with you? It's online for free. You can go to the CW's website and watch it on there free of charge. Go ahead, go, run, now, do it. Links are down there below if you need help finding it. I don't know why you would because of Google, but, you know, let's say you do need help and you're, okay, it's down there. And there are also other links below to follow us on social media. As always, please consider hitting that subscribe button down there. If you haven't, and next time I'll race the Flash and Superman to find out which one of us is truly the fastest.